CVC Capital Partners, the large private equity firm that raised a 26 billion euro fund in 2023, is acquiring Diff Capital Partners in a deal worth approximately 1 billion euros. So, what are the two main reasons why CVC is making this acquisition? Can you guess? Well, in our December 2023 video newsletter called Minsights, which you should subscribe to in the link in the description below if you don't already receive it, we took a deep dive into the two main reasons on why CVC is acquiring Diff Capital Partners. And we also gave a background of the deal and Diff Capital Partners in general. We are happy to share this video with you here, so stay tuned for our Minsights video newsletter. In this edition of Ming Sites, we will walk you through the Diff Capital Partners deal, a recent deal where CVC is acquiring Diff Capital Partners. We'll go through the history of Diff Capital Partners, followed by the details of the deal, and then we will analyze the deal. So let's get started with the history of Diff Capital Partners. The Dutch infrastructure fund manager that now has approximately 16 billion euros of investments under management. Back in 2005, DIF, which was later rebranded to DIF Capital Partners, was founded in the Netherlands to invest in the European public-private partnership sector. In other words, partnerships with governments that focus on investing in infrastructure, such as transportation, utilities, and various energy projects. Over the next 12 years, DIFF launched many new funds and opened offices to cover Europe, with offices in Paris, London, Frankfurt, and Luxembourg, to cover North America, with an office in my hometown of Toronto, and to cover Australia and New Zealand, with an office in Sydney. In 2017, DIFF launched a new strategy called CIF to focus on small and mid-sized core plus infrastructure investments. Core plus infrastructure investments are a little riskier than the core infrastructure investments of the traditional DIFF funds. In addition, the new CIF strategy focused on investments that have a clear buy and build strategy a strategy that will allow for many add-on acquisitions to be rolled in to the initial company or platform. An example of an investment by the new DIFF CIF Fund 1 was in 2018, when DIFF CIF Fund 1 invested into data centers, where it established a company called Edsger as a joint venture platform business that now has seven data centers that have been acquired through a buy and build strategy. Also in 2018, DIFF raised DIFF 5, which was the fifth core infrastructure fund that DIFF had, where it made many investments, including in 2019, when DIFF 5 invested in a public-private partnership in the city of Liège in Belgium, where it invested in designing, building, financing, and maintaining a new tram line in the Belgian city of Liège. DIFF continued to grow over the next few years. And in 2023, at the time of the deal we are talking about in this video, DIFF had 11 offices around the world, had made over 220 investments, and has approximately 16 billion euros of investments under management. So let's move on to the details of the deal. CVC, the large European private equity firm, is acquiring a majority stake in Diff Capital Partners in a deal worth approximately 1 billion euros. So let's analyze the deal. CVC has been in the news quite a lot in 2023. In addition to its September announcement of the purchase of Diff Capital Partners, in July 2023, it announced that it raised 26 billion euros for its CVC Fund 9. That's right, 26 billion euros in one fund. And this is in an environment 
when many firms are having trouble raising capital and private equity. Also in September, after the DIF acquisitions, news came out that CVC Capital Partners is looking to go public through an IPO. So why do you think CVC bought DIF Capital Partners? Well, I believe that there are two main reasons. Number one is cross-selling. I believe that CVC wants to cross-sell its customers. If CVC is able to raise 26 billion euros from investors for one private equity fund, well, I bet that some of these investors will have an allocation to infrastructure in their portfolios, an allocation that may come to DIFF Capital Partners in the future. And number two is the private wealth channel. I believe that CVC will want to target the private wealth channel by creating an open-ended vehicle in the future. Over the past year, many private equity firms have come up with open-ended vehicles to target the private wealth channel. For example, KKR has come up with K-Prime and EQT has come up with EQT Nexus. CVC currently invests in Europe, the Americas, and Asia across many strategies, including buyouts, growth, secondaries, and credit. By adding the infrastructure investing capabilities of DIFF Capital Partners, CVC should have a good base to create an open-ended vehicle for the private wealth channel to diversify across vintages, geographies, and asset classes. And who knows, after CVC goes public, it may use its new public shares to help make even more acquisitions to increase its variety of offerings for investors. Investors, many of the biggest private equity firms in the world are becoming more than private equity firms. They're becoming large alternative asset managers that offer private equity, private credit, infrastructure, and more. If you are looking for a one-stop shop for your alternative investment needs, and you don't have the capital to build your own alternative investment program, large alternative asset managers may be a good investment for you.